Online business tip. Writing for selling writing content with the intention to sell is a difficult job that people take for granted, similar to how hard it is to write comedy. The point is that people know that you are trying to sell them something. That alone arouses suspicion. And when you're selling through an e-commerce website, such as, that you are not selling face-to-face -face makes people, especially prospective new customers, even more suspicious. Add to that, this is a day and age where scams run even more rampant, and producers sacrificing quality to cut costs. It's a wonder people still manage to sell at all. Here are ways in which you can manage to appear more convincing. Make sure that your tone of voice is proper, and do not overstate. Marketers have a tendency to overhyper things, and promising superb, high quality, fantastic offers which end up to only marginally useful for the customer. In the end, this only results in an annoyed customer. So forego superlatives. Your copy should always show the source. If you are a bank, talk like a banker. If you are selling health products, talk like a health enthusiast. The copy must also be proper to your audience, as they probably will not appreciate being talked to like a group of children or a group of subnormal teenagers. Be specific. Being concise and being direct reassure people who you know what you are talking about and that they will get exactly what you promise. Spell out your offer fully and in concrete terms. Research shows that ads that use specific terms such as I saved XXXX dollar because of X and Y are more effective than ads that say I saved a lot of money from buying X. This also covers if your product is technical. Give out specifications, such as exact dimensions and volumes. This also goes if you are selling a compilation, a collection or an anthology. You should give out every title. Thus, you convince people that they are getting a lot for their money. And of course, somebody out there will always be looking for the one you miss out. And you will lose a sale. Ah, the one that would have made the ad a success. It's always tricky. Write in the present tense as much as possible. The words will, can, and could only imply. Thus, there is less certainty of the benefits compared to as when one would use the word is. So, use the present tense as much as possible. Thus, you say that this product does this. You feel this. Not it will do this. Or you will feel. Make it sound easy. Don't talk about the buyer having to do anything. Rather, talk about the product doing it for them. You can also be more specific here, like adding a time frame. This also goes out to how the customer will have to order or communicate with you. If it's hard enough or it involves a lot of complicated steps, they will most likely give up. Finally, restate your benefits before closing the sale. Bolster enthusiasm just before you ask for the money. Remind them what they get and what they miss out on if they do. Many people are now looking to make money online as a way to change their life. Discover a proven system and roadmap to do that. Better hurry. And go here right now to get your hands on it. HTTP. Irishmarketerwizardedsign.com.